full of drama. Um, are you surprised that you haven't seen more more sports put in put in put into theater? Well, there is more. Uh, they're doing a, a play on Lombardi and Broadway right now. Uh, Mitch Album up in Detroit is doing a one-man show on Ernie Harwell. So maybe this is a new trend, and I think the more successful each of these shows are, the more it will help all the rest of us. And we've done the show now in Atlanta, Milwaukee, Chicago, San Diego, Las Vegas, Long Island. Maybe forgetting someone. Um, and it's uh, the reward for me is to sit in the back of the theater and feel the audience, and the actor gets a standing ovation in every performance. He said in 30 years of, uh, of acting, he's never been so rewarded by any role as this. And the beauty is to see him go from someone who had to memorize it in an hour and 10 minutes of material with no one throwing him cue lines. He's out there alone. I mean, any actor worth his salt or her salt would never want to do a one-man show. It's tough. Uh, and to know the lines, and deliver the lines at the start. And now, to not only know the lines, but feel the lines, and it's from his soul, that he's become Al McGuire. Uh, it's like uh, uh, Hal Holbrook and Twain, doing Mark Twain. He's done it for 20 years. And it's, it's now the point where he is Mark Twain. In fact, uh, our actor, Cotter Smith, went to Holbrook in Hollywood and said, could I see the script, the original script? He said, there is no script. I just get up and I start, and the audience takes me wherever I want to go. <laughs> so it's, he's almost at that point. We've added, we've added material uh, as, during the course of this whole run, and he you know, assimilates it and uses it. And sometimes he throws something in that's not anything I've written, but it is something about Al that that we've learned uh, in this whole process. Uh, so it's uh, it's been you know immensely rewarding for him and to me. Fantastic. And just one more. Um, this will be the first time the play uh, is performed in Bloomington. Um, what, is it, what does it mean for you to uh, bring it back to a place that's special to you? And